Hi, my name is Heidi and I'm a pharmacist and today we'll be talking about how to inject cloudy insulin. Before injecting your insulin, check the expiration date to make sure it's not expired. Then roll the insulin between your hands for 15 to 30 seconds. You never want to shake insulin, you always want to roll it to mix it. After you're done, check to make sure that there's nothing settled at the bottom. And then use an alcohol swab to sterilize the top of the vial. At this point, take your syringe and remove the cap from the needle. And pull the plunger down to the amount of insulin that you intend to inject. In this case, I intend to inject 20 units, so I pull the plunger down to 20. Then I'm going to stick the needle into the vial and press down on the plunger to inject the air into the vial. Turn the whole thing over and then pull the plunger back to 20. If you have bubbles in the syringe, you can pull past and then push back up to push the bubbles back into the vial. Then turn the whole thing over again and pull the needle out. At this point you're ready to inject. Insulin can be injected into the upper arm, the abdomen, or the thigh. Make sure that you're rotating sites within the site so that you're not injecting in exactly the same spot each time. When you are injecting, make sure you go in at a 90 degree angle to the skin. Put the needle in the skin. Press down on the plunger until all of the insulin is injected. Then wait five seconds. And then withdraw the needle. Place the whole syringe into a sharps container. If you have more questions about injecting insulin, please contact your pharmacist or doctor. Thank you.